Why the don't be afraid? You know what's there to be afraid of? <laughs> Everything's normal in this kitchen. <laughs> right, around we go. Thank you. I'm just going to close the door because it could get a bit messy in here. Right. Well, here we are in our kooky kitchen and we're going to dish up another daft dinner. What I like about this kitchen, of course, is I've hand-trained all the ingredients myself. Take a look at this. This is my friend, the tomato. In fact, it's a homing tomato. Here we go. Come back to Mummy. Thank you. OK, right now, one member of each team has got to make a leaning tower of pizza. Uh, but they must be as big as possible, and each layer must be different, OK? Now, you've got to find ingredients that are cunningly concealed, or rather not, in our kooky kitchen, OK? So, away you go! <laughs> oh. This is going to be a pizza to remember. What have you done to this, John? What have you done to my... My cupboard was full and now it's empty. I'm going to have to go shopping again. OK, there we go. This is quite an unorthodox pizza here. Please, folks, otherwise, you know, my indigestion, it's just a boy. OK, fine, that's what we'll do. I don't know, why am I standing here? Stupid place to be. I'll get out of the way and have one of these donuts. Have a nice indeed. Watch out, run for your lives, it's a mad kind of donut! Ah! OK, oh, what have you done to my wall? Now, that wasn't in the deal. You said you'd come round and make some pizzas. OK, then, oranges are doing very well. They've got the mushrooms in there. It's a mushroom pizza. What are you doing, John? You're supposed to hold the pizza there. Let me give you a hand. OK, there we go. Idea. Fantastic, OK. Right, they're not all over her, over the pizza. Right, that's enough. Hold it there, teams. Hold it there. Well, I must say, it's another messy time in the kitchen and you're going to be doing the washing up. Right then, so let's just take a look at it, shall we? Then hold your, hold your pizzas for a second. Right, well, um, that's a medium pizza, I think. A medium pizza base. And let's take a look at the top one here. This is a huge pizza, yes. One fit for Pavarotti. Well done, I think it's the oranges have it. And they have ten points. Well done, oranges. Cyril! So after that delightful round, the oranges are still in the lead with 40 points! Um, I think it's time for a bit of a quick clean-up as we go in for our next goofy round. Outside! Come on, guys, you can manage it. I'll push you right on down. I'm surprised we're not sticking together after that round. Right now it's time to play vice versa. I'm going to give you a description of an object or not what. So cool because you have to go over to the potty shed, over there, and bring me back not what I described. So if I say I want something that's not the colour of snow, I'd actually want something white. OK? Simple as that. Right now, here are the clues for the not what I want you to bring back. It's not found at the seaside. It tastes nice. It's not stripy. There's the three clues. OK, let's see. In the greens, we've got John, you're playing, aren't you, of course? Yep. Right, job. Yep. OK. And in the oranges, we've got Eloise. Yes. Covered in absolute stomach, all this. <laughs> Horrible. OK, fine, then. You've got 30 seconds the moment you get into that potty shed. But first of all, if you want to play this at home and you don't want to know where the object is, close your eyes now! OK, you can open them again. Right, then. Are you ready? Got 30 seconds, as I say, once you get to that potty shed. Away you go! <laughs> and stand here. Well, let's see how well you've done. Of course, the clues again. Not found at the seaside, it tastes nice and it's not stripey. Uh, let's go to you first, John, shall we? And yeah. see what you've got here. Are you confident with that? No. <laughs> yeah, I wonder why that is. OK, let's go through it then. Not found at the seaside, which means it is found at the seaside. Why you'd find a ball at the seaside, so we'll give you that. Um, it tastes nice. That means it doesn't taste nice. Could you just confirm that for us? 
Does it taste nice? No. Okay, of course not. Okay, and it's not stripy, which means it has to be stripy. Not really very stripy. You got two out of three, so that's 40 points to the greens. Yeah! Right. Down to you, Eloise. And what do you think about yours? Do you think you've got it? Yeah. You think you do? Oh, look at this. Okay, well, let's go through it there. Not fan of the seaside. Well, I think you probably want to find that at the seaside. Uh, it, it tastes nice, so it doesn't taste, it tastes nice, so let's just confirm that as well, please. No. Oh dear, oh that hurt. Okay, and it's not stripy, it means it has to be stripy, that's exactly what you're looking for. That's three out of three, so it's 60 points. Well done to the yeah. oranges. Bang some more, Sewell. And that means that oranges are still in the lead with 80 points. Yeah. Very well done indeed. Okay then. Yeah. Oh yes, you're right, Sewell, that this outdoor life is a bit healthy, so let's get indoors. Yeah.